In this video, what we're going to do is take a look at some of the place note terminator options. So again, we'll go to our text toolbox. We'll make active the place note tool, number two on the list. We'll take a look at our tool settings window that appears. The dimension styles, currently this is set to style of none. This is, means whatever your active settings are. Our text rotation is horizontal, frame is none, text height is appropriate for what we're doing. And I've expanded the tool settings window. So we have location set to automatic, leader type set to line, start at is terminator, horizontal attachment is set to auto, inline leader and association are both checked. So what we're gonna do is take a look at what do the arrowheads look like straight from headquarters as per the seed files. So we'll go ahead and place in a note and we'll take a look at the arrowhead. So there's the arrowhead. It's the AHT arrowhead supplied from the Caltrans headquarters cell library. So that's out of the box. Now we're going to see how we can change that if we want to. Now to do this, we're going to go to the tool settings window again. We're going to go to the dimension styles dialog. To the right, click on the magnifying glass. This will open a rather large dialog box. It's dimension styles. Across the top, you'll see five tabs. The one we're interested in is called Geometry, and the area that we're interested in is Terminators. And right now, the height and the width, these are set, again, in the seed file by headquarters. So what you inherit when you create a new file using the seed files, that's the, the width and the height that you get. So this is what most people are, are encountering without making any changes to it. Below that is Symbols. I'm going to click on this button here, and you're going to see a series of options. Now, the one we're interested in is just Arrow. And you can see it has three options, cell, symbol, and default. Cell is what headquarters set it to. It's going to be the AHT arrowhead. Symbol means you can put in a font, whatever your active font is. And then the other option, what we're going to explore, is default. Now I'm going to set that to default. And then the arrowhead up here at the top, we're going to change that from open to filled. And we're just going to place in the same note again. And what you're going to notice is the arrowhead appears somewhat like the AHT arrowhead, but it's not a cell. It's just a filled in triangle. Now with that, some groups like to change the appearance of that arrowhead. They like to put in a longer, wider arrowhead. And we can do that by changing under the terminators, the height and the width. So what I'm going to do is change this to, let's say 1.5 for the width and then 0.5 for our height. Again, I'll place in the same exact note, and what you're going to notice is a very different looking arrowhead. So those are just some of the basic options for placing in place note and changing your arrowhead or terminator options.